I'm Lloyd Walker from Walker Audio, and I'm here today to give you tip number one of ten on how to get better sound from your audio system. Now, the first tip is to clean and treat your source material. Now, we'll start with the CD. When a CD is pressed, there is a release film that's left on the CD to keep it from sticking in the pressing process. Also, your CDs get minor scratches on it and gets dirt and contaminants from the environment. This needs to be removed so the laser can read the information correctly. Now, don't get lazy here. Spend a little bit of time and clean this CD. You'll be rewarded with much better sound. Now, there's some products on the market, uh, and there's two types. One uh, is a rebadged lens cleaner that will clean uh, this some of this film off and it will help the sound and there's another type that has abrasive in it to remove scratches now to remove these scratches it has to put a, a lot of small scratches on it to remove the major scratch and this is just as bad as the big scratch is now our product we make one called the ultra vivid that will remove this film it has an optical enhancer in it that will render the plastic transparent and also the scratches transparent so the laser can read the information correctly. Now, this CD will sound just one heck of a lot better if the laser can read the information that's on the CD and the error correction system does not have to guess that what might be on the CD. So, you'll enjoy the music a whole lot more. So take a little bit of time and clean your CDs. Now next, the LP. Now the LP also has a release agent on it to keep it from sticking in the molds when it is made. And this has to be removed. Plus, an LP gets dirt and trash and oils and everything on it. And anything in this groove is going to distort the needle trying to read the information. So this has to be removed to get the best sound. Now, there's some products on the market that claim to do this with a single step. Well, this is not really true. And I like to use an example such as washing your hair. If you wash your hair and you do not rinse, your hair is still dirty. So is the LP. Now, most of the time, you might have to wash your hair twice and rinse twice to get better, get your hair cleaner. And that's the same thing with an LP. So you might need to wash and rinse twice. We make a product called the Prelude that's a four step. And it's two special cleaning agents and two different steps and there's two rinsing steps. Now once you do this you never have to go back and do the four step process again. A single rinse will be good enough. And you'll be absolutely amazed how transparent and dynamic in detail and how smooth your music sounds if you do this. So take a little bit of time and understand what's happening with your source material and clean it. You'll be glad that you did. Now the next is step is to treat your CDs and your LPs. Now there is some demagnetizing units out there on the market where you have to take and put it in a remote device to demagnetize it or de-static it. There's de-static guns. There's a number of products that will actually do some of this, but it won't do it all. <clears throat> we make a product called the Talisman, and the Talisman will de-static, de demagnetize the CD and the LP both. Plus, it will relax the vinyl. So one, the laser can read the information better, and the needle can read, well, actually trace the grooves much better. And the talisman could be used on your cables and interconnects and power cords to enhance those. And as a side benefit, you can treat your speaker with the talisman. You'll be amazed at what happens. So treat your source material. It is most important. This is where it all begins. So any distortions or any inaccuracies there is going to have a huge effect on your musical enjoyment. So take a little time 
and learn how your system works. You'll be glad that you did, and you'll have some fun. You'll rediscover your entire music library. So that is tip number one of ten. Clean and treat your source material. Happy listening, and have a